with the holiday season coming up, I should crown myself the volleyball gift guide giving volleyball gifter. That was a really silly name. The volleyball gift guide guru. So this year, I really want to prioritize gifts that are going to be effective in your volleyball game, help you practice and prepare. Remember, good players, we practice all year round so we can be as effective as we can during our season. So this year, I really want to prioritize gifts that are going to help you train at home because you know I like to do a lot of guides at home, help you train in person and just overall help your game. So the first thing I get often a lot of questions is the volleyball net. Coco, I don't have a volleyball net and I don't have access to a net, so what should I do? So here are some different things that you can do. Number one, one of my favorite types of volleyball net, I really like this net because I've been using it for years and years and years as I've been practicing over the summer, as I coach over the summer, it's really easy to use. You've seen me do a video on how to set it up before. It's a wonderful, wonderful net, especially if you're looking at playing grass volleyball, you know people who want to play grass volleyball. It's something that's really, really, really great in that aspect. However, this net is a little bit on the pricier side. So I wanna give a high option and a low option. So this net is really wonderful because it's easy to set up. It's something that you can set up in your backyard. I like things that are weather resistant, something that's not going to destroy immediately when you leave it up or it gets rained on and it rusts. So this is something that is from Amazon. I've used this net before. I really liked it. It was really effective for what I needed at that time. And it's something that you can maybe ask on your Christmas list and you can have. So think about this net as something that you may want to ask as a gift, but if you need a higher option because you're playing with a higher level of play or you're looking at grass, try this option here. So these are both really great options so that you can weigh, but I like both of them. But let's give a big shout out to today's sponsor, Victory Performance Insoles. Now, I am a big, 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 big fan of safety. And one of the things that I've used throughout the years in my volleyball journey, my volleyball career altogether, are shoe insoles. They are so, so necessary because we plan our feet all the time. My grandmother told me a long time ago that you only get two pair of feet and you have to take care of them. And what that means is you want to make sure to have the best thing for your feet. So that way when you're playing, you can be the best effective player as you can, the best player that you can be, and you're protecting your feet in the meantime. One of the things that I really like about this insole is that number one, it's padded and cushioned, but also it has a performance bottom that that way it won't fray. It's not something that's going to be destroyed in my shoe because I'm jumping up and down the life of a middle blocker but it's also something that's going to slip into my favorite shoe and one of my favorite shoes that I'm using right now I am going to put it in that shoe so we can see how seamless that it fits in and how great it is. Now the cool thing about it is it's carbon fiber, which means that it has some shock absorption and that's something that's really helpful, especially if you're jumping a lot and you're a middle blocker or a player like me. It's made for athletes and they have a variety of sports and it can help promote a higher vertical. So right now I'm playing a lot of my crazy flights. So I have my crazy flights here, but I also have the insole inside. It fits so seamlessly inside and I can wear it with my sock, my volleyball socks, my half socks, even a little bit of a thicker sock if I really want to. One of the things that I really like is that it really keeps the integrity of the shoe. And I like that the hard bottom is gonna keep it from fraying on the inside. I've used various types of insoles before and they have frayed over time, right? I've been using them, I put my shoes in, they hold odor, they smell. And that's not something that can be easily on my radar all the time. I don't always have time to wash my volleyball shoes. So I really like that these hold the integrity of the shoe, that they are very solid, and there's something that's gonna help my performance big time. So make sure you check the link in the description below so you can get more information about Victory insoles so that way you can always be prepared for the game and you can play your best. Now, for what you've been waiting for, volleyball shoes. If you like, if you are like me, and you've had volleyball shoes and a lot of volleyball shoes, and you wanna know the best shoe to try out this year. Asking for them on your Christmas list or your holiday list is a wonderful thing to do. And I have some options for you. Now, I'm gonna give a beginner option and a little bit of a higher option, okay? One of the beginner options that have been popular for years and years and years, and I'm gonna show a shoe that I already have, is the Gel Rocket. I like the Gel Rocket for a basic shoe. I like the Gel Rocket for a beginner shoe. I like it because it is a little bit of a wider fit 
it has some really nice lines on it. I think it is stylish. I like this black and white one because it can fit with any uniform. It fits with what I wear. And this is Asics. I personally like Asics. I've tried Mizuno, a lot of other different brands, but I really like Asics for me because I have a wide foot. Coco has a large foot. She's a size 11 baddie, okay? But I have a large foot and it's wide. So Asics really mold to my foot and I really, really like that. I personally wear my shoes with insoles, which is why I'm so grateful for today's sponsor, Victory Insoles. So my Crazy Flights are a shoe that I've been wearing. Now the Crazy Flight is a really, really great shoe. It's very, very awesome. It's Adidas. So Adidas started making volleyball shoes. They've been making volleyball shoes for a while now, but when I started playing volleyball, we really had Asics, Mizuno, and some other smaller brands, right? So the reason why I like these crazy flights is because it has a little bit of a higher top and it has a little bit more of a curve here. As I've gotten older, I need to really prioritize ankle protection and ensure that I'm taking care of my feet when I'm playing. That's why I like to wear insoles in my shoes. I've been wearing insoles in my shoes for years and years and years. And to prove that to you, I'm going to show you one of my favorite pairs of volleyball shoes that have been worn to the ground. And I want you to take a look at the insult inside of it. So I've been wearing this shoe for years and years and years. These are one of my favorite volleyball shoes. If you watch my channel, you'll see early on on my channel that these are one of my most worn shoes ever of all time. And I have an insult in it. And I, you know, I was really thinking about how crazy this is that I've worn these shoes to the ground. And I'm not joking. My insole has been destroyed. I don't even need it anymore because it's been destroyed so badly. And the inside of the shoe is worn down so badly. There's like a, yeah, no, no. Goodbye. So I needed something that was a little bit more effective with a harder bottom. And that's where Victory Insoles comes in because I like, if you can hear this, I'm gonna do a little, I'm gonna do a little bit of ASMR. Am I an ASMR channel now? So I really like how this right here, I can promise you, it's not going to just fly away like my old insoles that I really loved. But these ones, I'm really excited to be able to keep these in my shoe, keep them for years on end, so that way I can't lose another shoe that I love. So when you are shopping for a volleyball shoe, and before you put a volleyball shoe on your list, I definitely suggest going and trying the shoes on. You have to see what kind of shoe works best for you. Sometimes we have shoes that are not as effective for us, or they're just something that's not gonna fit very well. There are a lot of great volleyball shoes out there. A lot of people like lower top, some people like higher top. You know, you might go through ages and stages and phases where sometimes I used to like lower top, now I like higher top shoes you need to try them on before you put them on your list but volleyball shoes are a great thing to put on your list or put on your gift guide for someone the next thing that you really ask for is a volleyball that is a correct size official weight volleyball now a lot of you guys have a lot of different volleyballs maybe you got them at Walmart or you got them in a different store but I really suggest you get a volleyball that's something that you can practice with consistently that is as similar to an actual official ball as possible because we really want to get we want that training to translate very well and if you get a hard outdoor sand grass volleyball sometimes when you're playing inside and it's a softer ball the weight can feel differently even if it's micro weight can feel different but those micro changes we don't want we want to make sure that your training really does translate so one of the volleyballs that I really like is the Molten. I love Molten. I really like how Molten has a really great ball. It's very soft, it's very affordable, and I love the L2. So the Molten is a wonderful ball to think about for that first time you're asking for a volleyball in your gift, or you're getting a gift guide and you really want a volleyball. Molten is a really great option, but you know, you know that ball I like, guys. You know I love this ball. It's on the pricier side. Not everybody plays with this ball. If you are playing school ball, school based volleyball, this ball's probably not for you. If you're playing adult volleyball at a higher level, this ball is for you. It's wonderful. I love it. It goes so fast when you hit it. It just slams it off. It's like fire on the ground. It's great, but it's a little bit on the pricier side. So these are two different volleyballs that you can really look at to ask for your gifts guide. Okay guys, this is my top gifts for this year as we're approaching the holiday season because we really wanna get some gifts that really will help us in our volleyball training. Please, huge thank you to Victory for sponsoring this video, providing us with some wonderful, awesome insoles for our shoes because we need to protect our feet. And I hope these gifts are something that you may ask for. I've gotten a ton of questions over the years about net volleyball shoes. So these are some of the things you can think about. Some other gifts you can think about are knee pads. You can think about some new volleyball spandex. 
Just things that you will need in the upcoming season so you're best prepared. With everything, I hope that you like this video. Please like, comment, subscribe, and I will see you guys next time.